Pancake, everyone! In this video, let's have a look at the giant beasts that were the largest representatives of their species. The largest animals of the Mesozoic era were the dinosaurs. Some were carnivorous, violent predators who hunted anything that moved. Others were unhurriedly stuffing their bellies with plant shoots and rainforest fruits. Gigantopithecus, the largest primate of all time. Fossils of the largest relict ape have been found in India, Thailand, and China. Paleontologists judge the size of the giants by the preserved fossil remains. Gorillas, which are considered the largest of the modern primates, are half the size of Gigantopithecus. A three-meter-tall ape could easily peer through the second-floor windows of any modern building by rising on its hind legs. The real King Kongs of the animal kingdom weighed over 1,100 pounds. Even the tallest man would not have been able to reach the chest of the relic ape, and would have looked like a small insect next to it. Perhaps the mighty beasts fell prey to the smaller, primitive human Pithecanthropus, who hunted with self-made axes and spears, and knew how to make fire and build homes. At the very least, with the advent of humans, the population of Gigantopithecus began to drastically decline, until they finally disappeared completely about a million years ago. The second item on our list is Amphicelius. Amphicelius was a herbivorous giant that was over 203 feet long. A truly enormous beast. This dinosaur from the sauropods family lived 160 million years ago in Africa and South America. It was over 203 feet long and weighed 134 tons. Imagine the size of the lizard if only one vertebrae was 8 feet in diameter. The body of Amphicelius, from its small head to the tip of its powerful tail, took up as much space as 25 cars parked in a row. It was not easy to feed such a beast, and perhaps the absence of sufficient food was the reason of extinction of the species. According to another version, predators were to blame for the extinction of the titans as they preyed on the clumsy young and ate with pleasure the eggs laid by dinosaurs. Third place, Gigantosaurus. Gigantosaurus is the largest carnivorous lizard. Its skeleton is up to 13 feet tall, and its skull can hold an adult human. It is the largest carnivorous lizard of the Cretaceous period, living more than 90 million years ago. The ruthless monster with a huge skull, short upper legs, and powerful lower limbs is familiar to us from the movie Jurassic Park. The remains of Gigantosaurus are impressive. Tyrannosaurus also belonged to the same class of theropods. These are predators that inhabited North America 68 million years ago. Size of the carnivorous giants 39 to 42 feet, body weight up to 8.8 .8 tons, and their razor-sharp teeth were 11.8 inches long. Even saber-toothed tigers had shorter fangs. And before we continue, please like the video and subscribe to our channel if you haven't already. There is a lot of interesting content on here. After this video, go ahead and check out our other episodes. And now, let's continue. The fourth position we give to Sarcosuchus. Sarcosuchus is the largest crocodile-like reptile. It is 49 feet long and weighs 15 tons. The huge crocodile-like reptile lived 110 million years ago in Africa. Compared to it, the modern crocodile looks like a toy. It fed on fish or preyed on other Cretaceous fauna. Its powerful jaws with several rows of terrifying teeth had an incredible strength of up to 22 tons, thanks to which the Sarcosuchus could easily bite into the thickest tree trunk. Next on the list is the Entelodont. It turns out to be a prehistoric ancestor of the boar, weighing up to 1.5 tons and standing up to 6 feet tall. This prehistoric ancestor of the boar lived 30 million years ago in Asia, Europe, and North America. And it struck fear into the hearts of not only potential victims, but also their own kind. This gigantic beast that weighed up to one and a half tons and reached a height of six feet was extremely aggressive and bloodthirsty. Thick skin, a predatory elongated snout with huge fangs, nimbleness, and here you have a real death machine. Paleontologists believe that entelodonts were cannibals, who could snack on weak and sickly congeners on occasion. Maybe this cute feature was one of the reasons for the extinction of the species. Next on our list is the Titanoboa. The Titanoboa is the closest prehistoric relative to the boa constrictor, up to 49 feet long and weighing up to a ton. The closest prehistoric relative of the boa constrictor was of a truly fearsome size. Its torso was more than three feet in girth, 
Its length could reach 49 feet, and it had a weight of a ton. The size of the reptile was twice the size of the anaconda, the largest snake in existence today. And do not think that the huge python silently strangled its prey in a steel embrace. Its method of hunting was more akin to the attack of a crocodile. The bloodthirsty monster attacked from ambush. Lurking in a body of water, he would look out for his prey and then suddenly lunge at it. After that, it would instantly bite its neck with its powerful jaws. It's a good thing these beasts became extinct 60 million years ago. We got to the most famous giant, the mammoth. The mammoth is perhaps the most recognizable on this list. A huge beast that resembles either an elephant or a rhinoceros. The largest members of the elephant family lived almost everywhere during the Pliocene. Fossils are found in Africa, Eurasia, and North America. Woolly mammoths were well adapted to survive in harsh climatic conditions. They inhabited Siberia, Alaska, and the cold islands of the Arctic. Scientists believe that the last representatives of their relict population became extinct not more than 4,000 years ago. Compared to modern elephants, mammoths looked like real giants. They were as tall as a three-story building, weighed no less than 16 and a half tons, had huge curved tusks, and a massive body with short legs. Their long trunk and strong tusks helped them get food from under the snow. The strong teeth easily ground up plant food, and a thick coat reliably protected it from the cold. Scientists are still arguing about what caused the mammoth's extinction. Some attribute their extinction to climate change, others believe that the giants were exterminated by ancient hunters. There is also an exotic hypothesis that claims that mammoths were the victim of a huge meteor. What do you think? Argentavis. This is the largest flying bird known to science. It has a wingspan of 23 feet. When you add to that its weight of 176 pounds and its height of 6.5 feet, it becomes quite frightening. Such a bird could easily carry a man in its beak and give him as a snack to its chicks. The ancient bird easily took prey from the saber-toothed tiger and held large carnivorous predators in awe. A female Argentavis could only lay one egg every two years. The chick grew slowly, reaching 18 months of age before it was able to feed itself, and it had offspring in 10 years. The largest prehistoric birds were long-lived, with their lifespan reaching 100 years. The Megalodon seems to be one of the most famous animals on this list. This enormous shark was so big that it ate whales. It is a bloodthirsty prehistoric shark that lived in the depths of the ocean 3 million years ago. The most complete picture of its appearance is given by the movie Jaws, in the plot of which the predator awakens from hibernation and proceeds to hunt people. In reality, the giant monster, over 65 feet long and weighing 60 tons, ate everything from ordinary fish and dolphins to huge whales. The powerful jaws with sharp teeth easily bite the fins and tail of large prey, depriving it of the ability to move. Then the Megalodon forcefully dragged away the helpless victim to devour it, which it did with pleasure. The open mouth of the ancient predator was enormous in size. A small boat could easily fit into it, and the compression force of the terrifying jaws was truly fantastic at up to 180,000 newtons. Even the giant blue whale could not escape from them. It is believed that these monsters became extinct due to starvation, because with the change of the world ocean level, many species that the ancient sharks were feeding on disappeared. The second reason for the extinction of the Megalodon is that whales became smarter. In the course of evolution, they became more agile and attentive, and so they easily swam away from the clumsy Megalodon. This is just a small part of the list of giants that inhabited the planet Earth in the past, and perhaps there are many more amazing mysteries and discoveries ahead for scientists. Which of these representatives surprised you the most? Let us know in the comments down below. And that'll be all, thank you very much for watching, have a good mood, and see you all again. Pancake everyone!